Hi, this is Mandy with Scott Leroy Marketing. Today I would like to show you how to archive and delete contacts from within your command database. That is how you would actually remove the contact from within your command account. First step is to go over here to the left to your contacts tab. Second icon down. And if you're looking to remove either a single contact or maybe a select number, you can go ahead and use your filters here to narrow down those contacts to make sure you're viewing only the ones that you want to actually remove. So maybe it's a certain tag that they have, whatever it is, you would use your filters to narrow it down and hit apply. Once you're done, you would see your contacts here that you're wanting to remove. You can either select one at a time or choose select all at the top. If you're working with a large number of contacts, you can also go right here to the right and make sure you're viewing up to 500 contacts at a time. That means you can archive in increments of up to 500. So we'll go ahead and select our contact that we want to remove. Notice your bulk action menu populates right here. From this menu, you would choose archive. It's going to ask you for confirmation that you really want to do this and you can go ahead and choose that archive button right there. You'll get a banner letting you know on the far right, letting you know that that contact was archived. It did have a hyperlink in that notice that you could have clicked to go view that contact in the archive, but I'll show you another way to get there. Your name and then settings. Being in the archive means that any marketing that you have set up has been turned off for them like smart plans or campaigns but the contact is still back here in kind of a data bank if you ever want to restore them back into command or if you want to permanently delete them so we'll just now go to command settings contacts and your contact archive this is where those contacts will be and you'll notice you have the option to restore and move them back to your contacts tab or delete them. And so our contact here, we can choose it and hit the trash can. This will permanently delete this contact. So we'll go ahead and hit OK. Notice it's a little grayed out. I can no longer select it. We'll just hit the refresh button in our browser and that should refresh it. And now that contact is gone. That was permanently deleting that contact. It is now removed from our command database. You could have chosen select all or multiple as well. And if you did that, you'll notice a delete, del delete selected permanently option up here to the right if you would like to do more than one at a time. If you're looking to actually wipe your database completely clean and you need to do all of your contacts at once, there is a database wipe option right here. The first option would move all of your contacts from your contact tab into your contact archive that we were just viewing. And then the second button will actually delete all of the contacts within your archive and delete them permanently. We recommend exporting a copy of your contacts before doing either of these options just to make sure that you don't lose any of your data. And if you're on a team, and these, then these options may be grayed out and you do not have this function. If you have any questions at all, please reach out to us at support at scottleroymarketing.com. Thanks for joining us.